what is up everyone this is oscar mtv and i'm back with another video and today's video is has been requested in my comment section and basically today i'm going to be showing you how to have um your controller being displayed on your streams or a recording like let's say you're recording a fortnite gameplay or any other gameplay as you desire and you want to have you know the little controller icon here and whatever button you're pressing on your controller this it displays it on your stream and then your viewers can see what are your keybinds or you know how, how your basic is like a hand cam but like a digital hand cam basically more like a controller cam in some type of way so what I use on um, to stream it's Streamlabs OBS so I have it right here um, let me just move it so I have Streamlabs OBS um, you could just download it it's a free software you go to streamlabsobs.com you download the software it's free um, and so I'm gonna open it up right now and I have it right here let me make it more smaller so you guys can see so basically you see the there's some options here this is different types of scenes so whatever scene I create here um, it displays it on my stream so the way I put a controller there is you have to go to this icon right here so basically there's options here so you make sure you're on this option and then when you make a scene you wanna go to sources so click this button right here and there's many of these things just ignore it for now but to add the controller go to browser source and then you wanna click add source I already have it I already have the link installed so that's why this pops out but you guys won't have that so let's say I'm gonna put add a new source instead so add source and then the UR URL that's where you're gonna put the link I'm a but I'm gonna give you the link how to get the link first in order to do this but if you're in Streamlabs um, go to your URL and then you're gonna paste the link here which I'm gonna show you right now so let me close this up right now so I'm gonna go in my um, Internet Explorer right now so we're gonna go to this website it's called gamepadviewer.com so that's you just type gamepad viewer you go to the website you wait for this little icon to pop out you want to click that and then let me just move um, my let me just let me just make this smaller so you guys can see so you're gonna go to these options so you, what you want to do is go to generate URL go to that so don't ignore all of this all you have to do is go to the player number it, it doesn't matter there's four players just choose a random one if one doesn't work choose player two if player two doesn't work choose player three that really doesn't matter I, I i choose player one and then this is what you this is the interesting part if you guys are playing on a playstation 4 controller and you want to show it as a playstation 4 display you choose if you want to if you want the icon to be a black playstation 4 controller or you want it to be a white me personally i have it as a white playstation 4 controller but let's say for people who play on an Xbox, you can choose Xbox 360 controller or an Xbox One controller. So me personally, I play on a PlayStation controller and I like the white version. So I choose the PlayStation 4 white. So now you just want to copy this link. So now it's copied. So what you want to do now is just you could, you know, close that. Open Streamlabs OBS again and then you want to go to the browser like I showed you click this icon um, let's see and then you go to browser source we already did that but now you want to click here like I showed you double click and then you just want to delete that and then you just go on your keyboard and you just um, paste it so when you click the paste button um, this is the link that you copied on the browser so you just click that link you guys can copy my settings I have it as a width of 800 height as 600 and then I have it as this and then just click done it's that simple and then you just want to minimize it because you don't want a huge controller showing you know in your stream 
and then you just put it whatever you want you, you know you could put it in the corner i usually i personally leave it in the corner a lot of streamers leave it on the corner or you could just have it here like let's say you're not having a face cam and then you want to sh just show your control you could put it right there and then as soon as you um, start using your ps4 controller it should start displaying it right here so like you can see right now um i have my playstation 4 controller it's connected to my pc and then see and there you have it guys it's that simple it's really easy so let me make it this large and then just f just to show you and then see like whatever button i'm pressing and if i'm streaming people can see how i'm basically playing so you don't really have to have a hand cam if you're a controller player you could just have this as a display and then just make make yourself stand out you know you know you want to be a streamer you want to be a content creator you want to you want to stand out you know you want to look more professional so if you want to make your streams more professional or you just you know you just want to have it because you want to be cool i i personally did it because i you know I, I like how it looks i got the idea from ghost aiden so shout out to ghost aiden um i give him the credit because i i saw him i think i he was the first one to do this so i really liked it and i just looked up how to do it and i'm showing you you guys because you guys requested this video and there's going to be a ton of videos coming up soon i'm sorry i haven't been you know streaming a lot because of my i've been working a lot but um, that doesn't mean that I'm not going to be posting videos on my channel. There's a lot of bangers I have planned and I will post them in the near future. I'm working on it. So that's about it for today's video. And before I end this video, if you guys play Fortnite and you want to support me, you want to support the channel, um, go to the item shop and you want to support a creator you want to support me just use oscar mtv click accept i will really appreciate it um there's um future giveaways coming soon i plan to do many things i'm still working on it it's it's very hard working a full-time job and doing youtube you know and i want to do both really good so um, i'm grinding i'm working i'm coming up with ideas i'm writing them down and i'll get them posted as soon as i can if you want to request a certain video, just put it on the comment section below and I'm happy to help, you know. If you need my help, I'm right here and you guys can DM me on Instagram, DM me on Twitter. I, I, I reply to everyone and if I haven't replied, I'm sorry. There's a lot of people DMing me, but I'll get back to you as soon as I can. So that's it for today's video, man. Make sure you like the button, subscribe, and I love you all. Peace.